there's already legislation coming out in response to that, mostly to do with liability and liability caps and changing the laws that govern these, these types of things. And I'm wondering if the Chamber has taken a position on the liability legislation, if you're lobbying on that. And additionally, given the President's announcement that um, he's he's postponing more offshore drilling at the moment, um, clearly you, you reacted to that a little bit earlier. I'm wondering if you can elaborate on the Chamber's position and what the Chamber is going to do about it in terms of speaking to, to lawmakers and policymakers on this. Well, you write for a legal uh, publication. It's generally not the... Um, the practice of this country to change the laws after the game. Um, uh, and I don't happen to know, maybe Tom does, I don't know, I don't think we're lobbying on that. I mean, we've been talking about it, but we're not lobbying about it at all. You're not lobbying on the liability law? Well. Why not? Because, no, I mean, I have a legitimate, uh, you know, our Institute for Legal Reform has been talking to people about this. Uh, my own view, uh, it's not right. Uh, there are a lot of other things going on. This, remember the, the, the comment I made, I, I like to do the surgery after we get the diagnosis, you know. They're, they're, everybody's going to contribute to this cleanup. We're all going to have to do it. But punitive, let's find somebody. I mean, you know, the president yesterday said he's responsible for all of this. I don't think he's going to pay for it. Uh, so, I, th I mean, I think we need to look at this in a very cold reality of what we have to do and how we're going to clean it up. Uh, I just don't think uh, running out and changing the rules in the middle of the game, we're going to have to get the money from the co government and from the companies, and we'll figure out a way to do that. I'm just not excited about what they're doing, but we're not lobbying on it yet.